to you. Austin Whitmore here with the Rodeo Trail. Tim O'Connell just won round nine with an 88-point ride. Tell me about that ride and, and what that horse is all about. Stud horse of Stay Smith's. Um, you can't ask for one to be a kind of a cooler feeling, cooler looking stud. I mean, he he played back with me the whole time, and I was driving my feet home every jump. And uh, he just kept staying hooked with me, and he turned back. He gave me everything I believe a judge wants to see in a bucking horse. He's big, he's strong, got off the ground, he had direction change, he stacked it up in one spot, and uh, he allowed me to turn loose and uh, just do what I do. And uh, when I can turn loose with both feet and, you know, click some flying Vs going up and down, you know, that's when I ride my best is when I turn loose and, and feel that spot. And, you know, it was just, uh, it was funny. I slid up on that rig in and I hit that rig in and I laid back and I was like, this is your money hole spot. Like I knew before I nodded my head that, the way I was sitting on the back of that bucking horse before I nodded my head, like I was going to turn it loose no matter what. And usually when I feel that, it usually works. <laughs> uh, it doesn't work all the time, but it dang sure worked tonight. Right on. Congratulations. So what does your schedule look like when you're out here in Las Vegas? I mean, we know you're at the arena, you know, in the evenings getting ready to ride. But what does your morning ritual, kind of your afternoons look like out here? Uh, I've been getting up at about 8. I've been trying to sleep till at least eight out here. And uh, I have shakeout workouts in the morning from 9.30 to 10.30 or 11. I go and get my hand worked on and my body worked on. From there, I have to more than likely change in the car to get over to Las Vegas Convention. I have one to two hours worth of signings. I'm done by one. We try to go get something to eat quick. Um, and, man, if I can spend 15 minutes with my kids, I love to do it. But it's it's tough. Um I wouldn't trade this for the world, but it's tough to be a father out here and uh, to see your kids and uh, not be able to spend a lot of time. Luckily today, I didn't have anything today, so we have a little uh, area where the pools used to be at, at the Virgin, and uh, it's all uh, turf now. So okay. me and uh, me and Hazen played soccer for a good hour today, oh, and awesome. Stratton was out there, and we just spent the day as a family, and, and I don't take that time for granted. And I love my fans, and I love doing signings too, so don't get me wrong on that. It's just a busy time out here. Yeah. And uh, with the, the the start time being at 545, you don't get that extra hour with your family every right. day. So makes sense. it's tough. It's a lot of running, but I wouldn't trade it for the world. Right on. Well, congratulations. Thanks for the interview. Thank See you, you at the South Point. Sounds good. Right on.